In normal creatine production, two enzymes are involved, agat enzyme and gamped enzyme. They work together to make creatine. Next, there are transporters that move the creatine into the cells of the brain and muscle where creatine is needed. In agat deficiency, patients do not have the agat enzyme. Because of this, creatine is not produced by the body. Creatine is important for supplying energy to the brain and muscles and supporting normal development. The treatment for agat deficiency is simple, oral creatine supplements. And if this is provided early in life, children can experience typical development. GAMP deficiency, patients have the AGAT enzyme, but they lack the GAMP enzyme. Because of this, guanidino acetate created by the AGAT enzyme builds up and is not converted into creatine. Guanidino acetate, also called GAA or GUAC, is a neurotoxin. It's harmful to the brain. The patient is also lacking creatine, which is important for normal development. The treatment for GAMP deficiency aims to reduce the guanidino acetate and supply the creatine the patient is unable to make for themselves. In creatine transporter deficiency, or CTD, AGAT and GAMP enzymes are functioning properly and make the creatine needed for the brain and muscles. The transporter at the cell membrane that moves the creatine into the cell is missing. This results in a lack of creatine where it is needed the most. There is currently no treatment for CTD.